We've had some people criticize us, stating we're teaching scammers how to be better at scamming. The truth is, in the decade we've been doing this, scammers have not changed their format, stories, or excuses. In reality, the things we expose educate people on what to look out for and how to look out for the red flags. How to prevent yourself from becoming a victim before it gets too far into the online relationship and knowing what to look out for is key. We teach people to demand video chat with someone they've never met and have the person write their name on paper while on video and hold that paper next to their face while on live video. A target victim can ask for this each time and a scammer will refuse as they are not the man in the photo. How is this teaching a scammer anything? The scammer cannot do this on command with a fake profile and stolen picture. We teach people what to look out for and how to educate themselves on what scammers say, do, how they operate, and raise awareness of scammers dating format and game. Their format has not changed. They still claim to be widows, best friend cheated with the so-called wife, they keep telling people they have one kid, the kid's always in boarding school with a nanny, and the ever-boring careers of oil rig worker, engineer, doctor, soldier, United Nations doctor, marine engineer, working on a ship, ship captain, and pilot are still the same old boring professions scammers use fake profiles with. Same old excuse of working abroad on a contract or working in the ocean. Unable to video chat and do things on command while on video and unable to prove they are real and always the same excuses as to why they can't. Communication is forbidden. Video chat is forbidden. I'll explode on the rig or get into trouble. I'll get arrested if I try to video chat. We've been dealing with and educating people since 2013 and the same stands true today as it did nearly a decade ago. They all use the same garbage excuses and lies. It's called the scammer dating format. We would rather teach 10,000 people how to spot a scammer and stay safe than one scammer learn anything from our channel and still at the end of the day cannot perform the tasks asked by a target victim when the victim is educated about online scammers. So while well, yes, scammers watch anti-scam channels and pages online, they still cannot change the fact that they are using stolen pictures, fake profiles, and that people are becoming extremely savvy and educated about their games. When it comes down to education, learning what to look out for and keeping yourself safe is what matters. Ask the tough questions, demand the video chat, request they write your name on paper, and have them hold the paper next to their face while on live video. This cannot happen if the person is fake. Also, don't send money or gift cards to people. The simple answer to everything is using the word no when someone asks for money or gift cards, your bank info, passwords, or codes. We're not educating the scammers on how to do anything differently. All the things they would need to do to prove themselves to victims simply cannot be done when they impersonate others. Keep safe, block, and continue to block and don't give out money or gift cards or your personal info. We hope that clears up some questions you might have. We're not educating scammers. We're educating potential victims and preventing the scammers from getting your money. Stay safe.